and welcome back to GWN Games Plays Paper Mario! Last time we got to Far Far Outpost, which is the town I was just in. And, uh, we- there was this- a couple of mysterious mice, and somebody gave us a hint about going- Oh! Woohoo! Barely dodged him. Um, going three blocks south and- or three, uh, sections south and one section- or two sections west from the- from this, from the stone spiny. So I think that's what we're doing. The other thing was, uh, there was a guy at the end of the town that, um, um, was asking about, um, us giving him an item or something, and, uh, I suspected that there was a code involved in it. Uh, so we didn't give him anything. Uh, so I is this... Okay, that's, uh, clearly... Alright, so let's go to this way. Woo! Whoop. And we're nearly there. Supposed to find something special here? There's a, a rock. And no enemies. Um, let's see. Can we... No bomb it. Damn, it was here. But they said there would be something special. Oh boy. Uh, this is uh troubling. What what if I jump on top of it? There we go. Uh, changes the sound effect when Mario's attacking. Uh, does that take any badge points to put on? I think there are such things as zero... yeah. I wonder what that'll do. Um, so I guess maybe we need to head back to town with that? Um, uh, I don't really remember what I'm supposed to be doing here, so, uh, I'll cut back to town. Alright, well, <laughs> on my way back, I decided to explore. Shoot! I was doubting them so well. Alright, well, I guess we, we ought to show these guys eventually anyway. Uh, they will, like um, uh, one of the guys in town suggested, uh, steal coins from you and then run from the battle. Unless you block and then they can't steal. Oh, he got it. Shoot. Uh, I don't think we can kill him fast enough before he leaves, so... Oh! Here's, uh... This is good that I'm showing this. Here's, uh... We'll increase your attack power. So that was from the lucky thing that I did last episode. Wow. A lot of extra damage. Not just a little. Um, but this guy's gonna get away anyway. Oh! We got our coin back. So if you just keep hitting him, you get your, uh... Your item or coin back? I'm okay with this. Should be definitely able to take this guy out. No problem. Okay. Well, that wasn't so bad. Um, I might try to figure out if there's an item in the middle. Oh, but yeah. I think I'm gonna have to fight these guys. I'll be back in a minute. All right. Well, that's all the guys in the area <laughs> done and dusted and. I think each one of these blocks is just a coin block. Not a bad deal. I did lose one set of coins, but everything else I was able to re recover. Um, and even the, the lucky spell gave me more coins at the end of one of the battles, too, so... I think I'm a at a net positive. Those guys drop a lot of coins if you defeat them, instead of them running away from you. I did get really close to dead. Um, got down to one HP. These guys are... Relatively tricky to, uh, to block. Let's see. Anything? Alright, well... And I've tried jumping around in the middle of this area. Because it's like, it's like a circle, and it could be a hidden block somewhere in the middle, but I don't think there is. Which is unfortunate, but we'll... Ooh! We haven't gotten one of these yet. This is a super block. but basically you can upgrade one of your party members. Remember, you upgrade will gain attack power. The party member will also master a new ability. Which party member do you want to upgrade? Ooh, boy. 
to Bombay. Yes. Alright, what is upgraded to Super Rank? Uh, can I look at her and see what new uh, ability she has? Power Bomb. Explode and destroy all enemies on the ground. So it's like Bomb, except it hits everybody. Really nice. That's what I was hoping to get. Uh, and I can't rustle any of these bushes, but it's a nice little oasis. Glad we accidentally came here. Ooh, and a health thing. I could definitely use that. Very good. All right, let's head back to town like I said we would. Oh, there's, uh... Ah, oh, damn, one more battle. All right, heading back to town like I said. Can zoom on by. I'm, I'm not sure, but, uh... I'm hoping the sound effect will... Uh, blah, 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 blah. Probably won't ever see him. Jojo, blah de blah. You know what? I'm just gonna go through town talking to people and there's a stone cactus. If you move three blocks south and two west from there, you'll find something. Special time, I'm not finding it. Sure how to find it exactly where. Uh, should we go there? Yeah? You wanna hear something else? Maybe we should keep talking to this guy. Because I don't think the sound effect badge is really what he was talking about. Uh, hey, did you know the desert is dangerous? Uh, you get blown away and lost. Appear all of a sudden really fast and they'll steal people's coins. Uh, unforgiving place. You wanna hear more? We've listened to that one. Hey, guess what? Here's something not a whole lot of people know. If you go south just after you leave town, you'll find an oasis. It's amazing. A paradise. If you go there, sir. I go there sometimes. If you wanna take a rest, it's a good place to go. You wanna hear something else? I'm sorry if you don't. I know lots of stuff. Alright, let's keep talking. Because that oasis thing was a good tip. Hey, know what I heard? Uh, there are uh, these three trees growing in a triangle somewhere in the desert. The rumor is that if you jump in the center of the triangle, you'll find something good. Only, I don't know where the three trees are. I mean, the desert is huge. I can't know everything. Hey, if you want to hear something else, I know a lot. Tons and tons of information. Yeah, alright. Guess what? Hey, somewhere in the desert, there's a stone cactus. Okay, so he's fully looped. Uh, I'm gonna continue talking to people in the rest of town, and uh, if there's something new, I'll, uh, I'll cut to it. I had another thought. Maybe we can give the information trader some piece of junk item that we bought at the shop. It's super cheap. Buy, uh, a, uh, a, uh, dried shroom here, and let's take it to this guy. Let's see if he does anything when I give him a uh, dried shroom. Ah, you give me something. You might be nice. If you're very nice, you'll give me something more. Oh, shoot. Well, uh, sure. Oh, you give me something. You might be nice. If you're really nice, you give me something more. Oh, boy. We're running low. Sure. My name is Sheik. I trade information, things others do not know. So, nice guy, what would you like to know? Uh, I mean, this is what we're ultimately after. You must see Mr. Malstafa to find the resting place of Dry Dry Ruins. Mr. Malstafa is a descendant of the great robber who built Dry Dry Outpost. He's somewhere in town, but yes, exactly where only his close followers know. I could tell his secret, but only to the nicest of nice guys, yes. If you still seek knowledge, you must give me something more. Do you understand? Uh, that's enough for now. Let's go get some more, uh, uh, dried shrooms. To be, uh, to give him things. So I guess it's not just, uh, um, a com- it's not like a secret combination where you, um, you give him something in particular. It's just quantity, so... I guess we'll just give him a ton of dried mushrooms. If we're stuck with a bunch of dried mushrooms, well then, that sucks. Uh, what about Dry Dry Desert? Dry Dry Desert is a vast and everlasting sea of sand. Underneath this sea, uh, many secrets lie buried. Many secrets than, uh, more secrets than were our stars in the sky. The Legend of the Dry Dry Ruins is one of these secrets. 
Only Mr. Mouse still often knows where the legend rests. Do you seek knowledge? You give me more, something more. Oh, okay. Let's give him another dried mushroom. Uh, what's his favorite food? My favorite food starts with an L and ends with an N. Uh, it's a uh, yellow fruit. So sour. Such a nice fragrance. Its tree grows in the desert oasis outside of town. If you were to go to the oasis and get one for me, I might believe that you are a truly nice guy. For, of course, the nicest of nice guys can meet Malstafa. If you still seek knowledge, you can give me something more. Yes, do you understand? Uh, no, I think that's enough. I think we can... We know where the oasis is. We can go get a lemon. And we also know to go, uh... Find a uh, spot in the desert where there are three trees and jump in the middle of them. Three trees in a triangle. That might take a while to find. Um, so let's go to the oasis first, because because uh, uh, I know where that is, or I thought I did. Uh, yeah. I wonder how we get up there. That must be later. Okay. Uh, that's three trees, sort of in a triangle. Hey, nice! Nice shrimp. That, I think that must have been what he was referring to. Nice that it was on the way to the oasis. And I didn't even have to cut for that. Alright, uh, let's try to find a lemon tree. Hey, there's a lemon tree. Can I get more than one? No. But we can give uh, the information trader guy a lemon, and uh, he'll tell us how to get to Dry Dry Bridge. Finally making some progress. No. Tree! Thank you. Even though it gave me nothing. Ooh, and lime. I'm, s I'm guessing the lime's good for cooking at some point, too. Zoom, zoom! Alright. I'll, uh, see you back in town. Alright, here we are. We will give him a lemon, his favorite food. Oh, heavenly, a lemon, the nicest of nice things. You have proven you're nice, you're nice by giving me my favorite thing. And since you're so nice, yes, I'll tell you something really nice. How to see Mustafa. To find Mustafa, go to the shop in this town. First buy a dried shroom, then buy a dusty hammer... You can spy them in the correct order. Yes, remember, dried shim and then dusty hammer. This is a secret sign known only to those uh, loyal to Malstafa. If you buy these things in the correct order, the owner of the shop will let you see Malstafa. Remember, you must not buy them in the incorrect order. If you still seek knowledge, you must give me something. Now, we're good. All right. I wish you luck in finding Mr. Malstafa, nice guy. Oh, thank you. All right, to the shop, we're gonna have to buy yet another uh, dried shroom. But dried shroom and then dusty hammer, right? Yeah, so buy the dried shroom and then a dusty hammer. In that order. Whoa! Buying a dusty hammer after a dried shroom is a secret sign that only the friends of Mustafa know. That means you're in with Mustafa. Hey, brother, good to meet you. Have any questions you need answered? You want to see Mustafa? He's usually on the highest part of Dry Dry Outpost. Just keep going up, my man. Uh, okay. So, uh... Let's see if we can find a, a way to finagle our way upward. Get up on top of that? No. What about on these? Can't get back there. How to get up higher. I mean, you can kind of jump up on, on these. Um, but I don't think that's uh, going to help us entirely. Ooh, the door's open. Sneaky, sneaky. We have a new path open to us. Very good. Alright. We're up. Getting up higher. Getting up higher. Information. Trader decided to uh, let us buy uh, a letter to traveling uh, nomad mouse on the road. Oh, well, we can uh, we know where he is. Uh, I think I can probably jump the gap, but why not just be safe and use paracarry? All right. Oh, information traders up here. What's what's going on, man? 
Nice to meet you. We meet again. I'm glad you found me. Big reveal! I am Mustafa. I'm the one you've been seeking all this time. When I'm out and about in Dry Dry Outposts, I use the name Sheik. It's always good to meet a genuinely nice guy. I meet people all the time, but you are by far the nicest guy I've met so far. Your name is Mario, yes? I've heard that you want to go to Dry Dry Ruins. I have a feeling you're on an important journey, so I will tell you the secret. Dry Dry Ruins is a very important place. My ancestors uh, have watched over it for many generations. If you do not keep evil folk out of the ruins, who will? You must be promised. Uh, you must promise that you will tell no one this secret. I'll give you this. The pulse stone. The closer you get to the dry dry ruins, the faster it flashes. This pulse stone is the key to finding dry dry ruins. Take it to the desert, yes? The pulse stone will flash above your head as you get close to the ruins. The closer you get to the ruins, the faster the pulse stone will flash. Follow it to where it leads you. Find the place where the pulse stone flashes and the, the fastest and use it to open the way. Alright. Thanks, Mustafa. And it's uh, nice that... Uh, <laughs> you are, um, uh, friendly enough to give us the tool to find where we need to go. So I guess, um, uh, well, first off, where's the, the guy in the, the desert? We, we can deliver the letter to him. Uh, thought he was close by. And he was definitely along the road. If you go southwest from here, you'll reach a beautiful desert oasis where you lemon and lime trees go. It's nice and cool. It's really the best place to get, have a rest, but many enemies play the surrounding area. If you plan on reaching the oasis in one piece, be careful. Traveling nomad mouse. Oh, traveling nomad mouse, right? Correct. My name's Barry. I deliver letters. I believe I have one for you. Hang on a moment. Another letter duly delivered. Postman's job is never done. A letter from me? From Mustafa. I've heard the name, but I can't remember who he is. Anyway, thanks for delivering it. I'm surprised you were able to find me way out here. It's, it's extremely hot traveling in the desert, so take care. Oh yeah, take this as my thanks. Don't hesitate, please take it. Star piece. Nice. Alright, so also the, the pulse stone is beeping slowly. Very slowly. Let's see if we can travel left until it's... Okay, it's definitely pulsing a little quicker there. Oh, that's even faster. Alright, let's keep going until it slows down and then we'll travel north or south. Okay, I think that's slower again, so let's, let's try going north. Oh, shoot, I've got a battle. Dried fruit. A fruit found deep within the dry, dry desert restores 15 HP. I'm sure we can cook with that, too. Cool. Um, I should, at this point... Well, I can't do it from there, right? Oh, no, that's not how you do it either. There we go. Use use up all the dried shrimps. We do definitely don't need them anymore. Uh, yeah. Okay, it's going even faster. Ooh, fire flower, always nice. Oh boy. And let's get this last one. Naturally, only the one in the center has anything cool in it. It's going really fast. Let's keep on going up. And... Yay! Alright, we're here. Pull stone! And it rises! And, uh, Colorado's going crazy! Town folks are like, what's going on? Mustafa's is like, oh, he used it. And so we find the entrance to Dry Dry Ruins as it just comes out of the, gra out of the ground. And of course it has to assemble. Uh, 
because uh, it, it had to be packed in so that it could fit underground, you know, because that makes sense. All right, and we have control. Definitely want to heal first. And uh, I think that's good for now. So thanks for watching, and next time we go into Dry Dry Ruins.